Hey guys, thanks so much for checking out episode one of The Locals. I just love how quickly people got behind the project and how many suggestions I've actually gotten for episode two. I've already been in talks with a few people for the next few episodes actually, and uh, the next one will take me up into Huntsville. But I'm right now in no New Hope Bikes and uh, working on another project with them. So first off, Andrew, tell us a little bit about New Hope and how you guys operate. So New Hope Community Bikes is a cycle education charity here in Hamilton. We run like a bike co-op so people can come and use our tools to fix their own bike. We've got cheap used parts so that people can stay rolling. Uh, as you know, the, if you've ever gone to fix your bike, it's really expensive to have tools to do that. Um, and so we make that really accessible uh, here in Hamilton. Amazing. And so obviously this is a community run shop here. And how did you kind of take that community initiative outside the shop, heading into the holiday season? You've got this other really cool program going on. So tell us a little bit more about that. Yeah, so for the past two years, we've been working with some of the youth in Pecanjicum, Ontario, which is about as far away from us here as Orlando, Florida, but it's still in Ontario. Um, so we sent a shipping container up there and we outfitted it as a bike shop. So it's basically replicating what we've done here in that community. And a group of youth up there have been running that to loan out bikes and to fix bikes and to lead group rides to the community. So coming up in February, we're gonna be doing an ice road challenge uh, to raise money for this bike shop that they've got going up there. Amazing, so my brother who's behind the camera right now, Brody and I, we're actually gonna be heading up to Pekanjigum with Andrew and 40 other people who are gonna be riding fat bikes along the ice roads there, right? Um, and we're gonna be documenting the whole thing. And along the way, I'm gonna be shooting some behind the scenes on how we're actually gonna be capturing this documentary and uh, showing you what the youth of Pekanjikum, how they live and uh, how this program has really helped them the last few years. Um, so tell us just a little more about the fat bike ride, some of the conditions you guys are actually gonna be in in February. Yeah, so I mean, the ice road is only in from about January till March, and that's the only time that the ice is actually thick enough to drive transport trucks on. So you've probably seen that Ice Road Truckers reality show. Uh, it's kind of, it's going to be like that. So it could be minus 40 when we ride. Um, we're gonna have some tents set up along the way where people can warm up, eat lunch, that kind of thing. Uh, but it's gonna be pretty, uh, cold. <laughs> pretty, pretty cold, for sure. So. Um, so Again, I keep saying this, but we're heading into the holiday season. How can people actually get involved if they either can and want to know more about the ride or if they just want to donate to the program in general? Yeah, so we uh, run any of our fundraising through Canada Helps. And so you can go to canadahelps.org and you can look up New Hope Community Bikes. You'll find our fundraising page there. You can make a donation uh, and you can also find our event for the Ice Road Challenge there. Amazing, so I'm gonna leave that in the description below so you guys know where you can maybe go donate a couple dollars, anything helps obviously, or if you wanna maybe see if you can get in on the ride, if you're crazy enough, uh, that's gonna be an option as well. So thanks so much for checking this out guys. Episode two of The Locals will be coming soon. I'll keep you updated on that.